September the 8th. Working around the place this morning, noticed these bees in the air. We've either got a requeening mating flight going on. We've got a little swarm because of a requeening. Not that not that many bees in the in the air. Didn't quite make it over here in time to find out which box they came from. If you remember last October the long hive did this. Messed around out here for quite a spell and then went back to the long hive. And I got a new queen out of that deal now. As it were, it didn't make any difference. Those bees got robbed out due to low numbers. The long hive's chock full of bees right at the moment. Um, bees are in great shape. Been in a little bit of a nectar flow. So, I don't know. I, I see a spot they've got them a limb picked in here. in the cedar tree. They don't really want to, don't really act like they want to ball up right there just yet. Bees to my right, they're checking out limbs on a pine right here. They're pretty, pretty unsettled about what's, what's transpiring here. They do appear to be coming into this limb more so than not. I don't know. We'll just have to watch, wait, and see if it bags up and stays or if it falls back apart and they go back to a hive. I don't know. We'll find out. Got a couple interesting things going on right at the moment. Had I continued having this camera rolling, I could have showed you the dragonfly flew in here and caught a bee and landed on my leg. So I've got the camera back on now after I missed that event. And I've noticed this little clump of bees out on the end of this branch. So as I get my camera back out to see if I can get the, the footage of the queen that's in that little clump, I think she has flown from that location. Oddly enough, that queen was lit out here with about seven bees. And the rest of them are focused right here. The queen, the queen looked to be a, a real healthy queen. Who's to say that virgin or mated, I don't know. Definitely, definitely a swarm caused by a queen requeening or otherwise i don't know these, these bees are very i guess you could call them very nervous they're not actively piling up on this on this branch which kind of makes sense due to the fact that the queen was sitting right there when I saw her. So obviously while I was getting the camera turned back on where we could, I could video to see if they'd come to her or what was gonna happen, she flew. You, wanna, you want to suspect that she flew over here into this little, little bag of bees. It was just 
the luck that I caught her out there. If it hadn't have been for that little water bees, I probably wouldn't have paid any attention to it. I don't see any, any drones at all. So we've, we've cast a little swarm. We've got a, we've got a queen out of a hive for some reason, superseded, mating flight. They're gonna hold a spot, she'll go mate, return, they'll all go back. Lots of things goes on with these honeybees this time of year that we don't even don't even know. A lot of people, you know, myself included, had I been at work, this would have happened, and I'd either come home and found these in this cedar tree, or they would have been gone and and somewhere else to live or back to the hive. I don't, I don't know. That's what they do. They do it on there their time and their dime. Anyway, a little interesting activity here at the farm in September, beautiful day. Low of about 50 this morning. Till we see you again, roll that beautiful bee footage. <laughs>